Hi and welcome back to my channel. This is Vanessa from R.A.M. Beauty Makeup. If you want to see how I created this look right here, please continue to watch and don't forget to like and comment and share my video. Okay, so we're going to get started with this look. The first thing that we're going to do, we're going to um, do our eyebrows and we're going to use Morphe Latte Brow Pencil. And do light strokes, don't go in too harsh with it because you don't want it to be super dark. Now I'm going to do the other eyebrow. Comb your hairs up and start filling. Okay. So now we're going to carve out our eyebrows using the Tarte concealer or any concealer that you guys have at home. We're going to put a little bit of a dab on our hand and it can be any flat little brush, something like that. Dip it into the concealer and start carving your eyebrow. Okay, so now we're going to use our primer, which is from Morphe. It's translucent and this helps for your eyeshadow to last longer and for it to stick onto your lid. So take a little bit and put it on your hand. You can use a brush or your finger to apply it. And get started. We're using the Morphe Jeffrey Collab. And we're going to start with, we're going to start with uh, Mr. Diva shade right here. My, the brush that I always like, this one, which was the MAC um, 323. Dip it in and start putting it on the crease. Start putting it on the crease and start doing windshield wiper motions. Like this. Now we're going to go in with um, the shade Chanel, which is this one right here, with the same brush. Tap up the axis and start a little bit more lower, just a little bit. We're gonna go in with um, was that T, which is the shade right here, and we're gonna go in with a little bit more of a little pointer brush, and this one's for Morphe um, M139. Dip it in. Let's 
start going in. And now I'll start kind of buffing it out, blending it out. Now we're going to take another brush and this one is the Crown C511 like that and it doesn't have any product in it so just buff it out. I'm going to take another brush this one's from Morphe the M411 we're going to go in with the shade Mogul Put a little bit of that. So like that. Okay, we're gonna go in with five oh six. We're gonna take the darker brown. And it says, um, hi dude, darker brown, hi dude. Grab a little bit. We're going to use that only in the inner corner. And then go in with a fluffy brush, the C511 point crown. And buff it out. So it looks like this. And now we're gonna use a little bit of our um, Aurora Lights palette. Looks like that. And we're gonna go with the shade um, Polar. Just this blue right here, sorry. Right, right there, Polar. We're gonna use a little bit of this glitter base from NYX. We're going to put a little bit of that on our eyes because it's very pigmented. It has a lot of glitter. And just pat it onto the lid. Okay, we're going to use um, the Urban Decay flat brush. Going with the blue. Ooh, super bright. Make sure to press it in so you don't get so much um, fallout. A little bit of ombre. I'm gonna go in with a flat brush like this. This is a smudging brush, but it's okay. It's from e.l.f. A little bit just in the inner corners. And then we're gonna take a little bit of um A little bit more of a purpley. We're gonna go in with gleaming, gleaming from the BH Aurora Lights palette with a Morphe M three two one. I feel like it needs a little bit of purple in here. Like that. We're going to blend it out. And 
e.l.f. smudging brush, blend it down. Just kind of like ombre. Morphe M 330 brush. I'm gonna blend it out. I'm gonna take a wipe and we're gonna clean out the edges. I'm gonna be using the Maybelline Black is Black eyeliner eyeliner and with an angle brush that looks like that any angle brush that you have at home you can use and we're going to start doing our eyeliner so I'm creating it I like to follow a little bit of the um, lash line like that now we're gonna go in with our foundation same one that I love Too Faced Born This Way take your beauty sponge and start putting it on pressing it in Now we're gonna go in with our corrector. We're gonna be using the Ben Nye uh, Media Pro Corrector Wheel. I'm gonna be using these two shades right here, the peach and the orange. We're gonna be using it on a flat brush, Crown C509. So grab a little bit of that peach color. I have these really bad dark circles lately. I don't know. Now we're in quarantine, but I don't know why. I've been sleeping, but don't know why this is happening. Okay, take the orange. I know you guys are probably like, whoa, it looks super orangey. Coral. It's okay. When you use your concealer, shape tape, light neutral. Taking our beauty sponge and blend it out. So, how is everyone so far doing? I know that we can't do much and go out, but how are you guys keeping yourself entertained at home? Comment below and let me know what you guys are doing. Okay, so we're going to be also using um, Laura Mercier Secret Brightening Powder to set our concealer. I'm going to make sure you don't have any creases underneath the eyes. Leave it on there for a few minutes. It's called baking. I 
And the brush that I'm using is just a, I think it's from Target, I think from the brand Sonia. So let it sit there for like a minute or two. We're going to be going in with um, the Mention Effect Contour Stick. It is in the effect number 14. Like that. The shade looks like that. We're going to be do using this to contour our face. I know it looks weird, but it's okay. Now we're gonna take another clean beauty sponge to blend it out. For our bronzing, we're going to be using this palette from Benefit, Cheerleader Palette, and we're going to be using the shade Caramel and Hula. We're going to go in first with Caramel. And now we're going to blend them out. For our highlighter and blush, we're going to be using Cookie and Gold Rush. Put it on your cheeks. Now we're taking our Morphe brush and we're going to use Cookie. And this Morphe brush is the M501. Now we're taking our bronzer contour brush that we use to blend it all together. So the lashes that we're going to be using are from Ardell, the 250 Mega Volume. Put a little bit of glue, which I already did. You wait 30 seconds and wait for it to get tacky. Now we're going to do the bottom. I'm going to go in back with the, the brown color using the flat definer. And start pressing it in. Same brush. And take a little bit of um, Mr. Diva, just this color right here. Then take, then take a pencil brush like this. This one's Crown C515. Crown C515. With the same pencil brush, I'm going to put a little bit, I feel like it needs a little bit more of that orangey. 
that we used up here. Oh yeah, it makes a difference. Eyeliner with a Brinda K. Put a little bit of it on your waterline, bottom waterline. I'm going to take an angle brush. We're going to grab a little bit of ombre. I'm going to put it in the inner corners ombre from BH palette put it on the inner corner take a little bit of welcome and put it on your brow bone We're going to be using this L'Oreal shade in four sixteen L'Oreal. Then we're gonna go in with Boho from Morphe. I think it's their holiday set and it's a lip gloss. And that is it for this makeup look right here. Something very playful with color that you guys can do on any occasion. If you like how I created this, please don't forget to like my video, comment, and share. See you next time. Bye-bye.